You've probably heard that when you rub certain things together, like rub a balloon on your hair, uh, they pick up static charge, which means that one of them becomes positive and the other becomes negative. One of them loses electrons and one of them gains electrons. What they often don't mention is, how do you know which is which? Like, which substances tend to lose electrons and which ones tend to gain it? There's a name for that. There's a table, a ranking, called the triboelectric series. And things like fur, hair, wool, glass, mica, things like that tend to lose electrons. When you scrape them, they become positive. And then things like rubber gain electrons. So when you are scraping the balloon against your head, against your hair, your hair is becoming positive and the balloon is becoming negative. And if you Google for triboelectric series, you will find a lot of images with long lists of different substances. So you can compare different metals, you can compare all sorts of things. But to do that, you need to know the name of it and how to look it up. So it's the triboelectric series. And so Benjamin Franklin was faced with glass and silk. He was rubbing them together. He's like, which one am I going to call positive? And well, we wish he'd chosen the other way, but that's life. Hi, I'm Robert Cruikshank, Robert the Tutor. If you're enjoying my videos, uh, please check out all my other playlists and uh, feel free to like, subscribe, donate, uh, tell your friends. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I appreciate it. And I hope this is helpful. Have a good one.